Well, they are cute and they are furry, but are they a smart holiday gift? The Animal Foundation is offering adoption incentives, but they're also advising the public to rescue responsibly. 8 News Now reporter Karen Castro is live at the shelter near Mojave and Bonanza with more on what you should know. Hi, Karen. Hey, Denise. Well, a lot to consider if you're looking to add a pet to your family or perhaps give a dog away to or a cat to someone who really wants one. Of course, the shelter wants to see every single one of their animals go to a loving home, but say they come with a lot of responsibility. A busy kickoff to their holiday promotion. Cats and dogs six months and older are free through December 31st at the Animal Foundation. We have stockings um, full of toys already for uh, the other dogs. We're going to get some stockings full of dog toys for this one too and some treats. Paul? Anthony Gerardo and his wife are adding a third dog to their family just in time for Christmas. It all worked out really well because I, I promised her we could get another dog. Gerardo and his wife agreed to gift themselves a rescue dog they are naming Hollow. It's probably a good idea to be on the same page when adopting a pet for your family or someone else. The best gift that you can give this holiday season is the gift of a loving home for a shelter pet. But adopting a pet is a big decision and one that shouldn't be taken lightly. As far as return rates, Kelly Leahy with the Animal Foundation says it doesn't increase with any of the promotions they offer. There's actually research that shows that free promotions work just as well as uh, adopting a pet for a fee. She says as much as they want every single pet to get adopted, they first want to make sure they're going to good homes. People assume that a pet will just naturally settle in to a home, but a shelter pet requires patience and love and understanding, just like any animal. So it's important that people know that up front and that they don't expect miracles overnight. Gerardo and his wife have been down this road before. They've rescued two other dogs and are ready to get to know the new member of their family. You uh, don't really know what to expect, but sometimes it turns out really well. And I'm hoping for the best with this one, too. And if you're still on the fence about adopting, perhaps fostering is for you. The Animal Foundation is actually offering a promotion. Take an animal home for a week. They'll provide everything you need. And if you decide to adopt, they'll waive the fees. Here, if you want to adopt Ellie, she's available. She's one years old, and she is very, very sweet. I've really taken a life into her over the last 20 minutes I've spent with her. Reporting live, Karen Castro, 8 News Now. I think that she might be going home with Karen. <laughs> she might, yeah. Oh, let's call